We've got temperatures this morning in the mid and upper 60s. Some of us are near 70 degrees like Kiwani. A little cooler up in Pembine, 63, 65 in Oshkosh. Dew points not terrible this morning, but we are going to see a gradual increase in humidity values later on during the morning hours and just carrying over throughout the day. And part of the reason why is we got a southerly wind and it's transporting more of that muggy air, which is also responsible for some of these showers and storms ongoing right now. There's a line of them just east of Eau Claire up through Rylander near Wausau. And this line of storms is going to be projecting to fall apart a little bit throughout the morning hours, but then there's going to be an additional line that develops later on into the afternoon and evening. More showers and storms farther towards the west. Now, with the additional storms expected later on today, there is a slight risk and a marginal risk for severe weather over parts of Wisconsin. A closer look across northeast Wisconsin does have areas west of Highway 41 having the better chance of seeing some more strong organized severe storms over the afternoon and evening. So with the risk of storms, it does look like all the categories are possible. Tornadoes, hail and even gusty winds best chance over central Wisconsin and southwestern Wisconsin. As the storms progress eastward, they're expected to lose a little bit of steam, but something we'll keep a close eye out on later on this evening. As we time it out on Skycast, 3 o'clock, breaks of sunshine, but farther to the north, a few thunderstorms. But as you get into late tonight, this is between about 7 8 o'clock or so, you'll see more showers and storms rolling through and continuing into the late evening into the overnight. Now, by tomorrow morning, it does look like a few isolated showers are possible. We get a little bit of a lull during the mid-morning, early afternoon before additional chance of some showers and storms pass through. What's going to happen is, as the cold front moves southward, it's going to stall over parts of eastern Wisconsin, and that's going to keep the chance of rounds of showers and storms to persist into the most of the day or the majority of the day for tomorrow as well as top of today. Because of that, a lot of moisture. We could see certainly some totals upwards of one to two, maybe even more than two inches of rainfall out of the system. So today we climb up to 82 winds out of the south at 10 to 20 miles per hour. Tonight will cool down to 68, so not much. Winds out of the northwest, though, coming in at 5 to 10 miles per hour with additional showers and storms. Tomorrow we climb up high of 77. Winds out of the north northeast at 5 to 10 miles per hour. We get up to 70 or 84 for your Thursday, 87 for Friday, then getting pretty hot by the weekend. Highs near 90 degrees Saturday and Sunday with an isolated shower or storm possible. All right, thanks, Gino. Still to come, if you miss seeing people's faces since they're covered by